Now to the latest on the Henry County water rescue turns search and recovery. A 49 year old Alex Smith was found dead by Toledo fire dive team on Saturday night. Our Michael Sandlin spoke first to responders about what it took to give Smith's family a peace of mind. On June 25th at 640 PM, the Henry County Sheriff's Office got a call about a possible drowning in the Maumee River, just west of County Road 4A. The Sheriff's Office says the witnesses on scene saw Smith fall off a boat and into the water, but never surfaced. The Sheriff requested mutual aid for the rescue mission, filling the river with boats from the Coast Guard, ODNR, and numerous fire departments, including two members of Toledo Fire's dive and rescue team. So they, uh, he went into the water began his search patterns, um, that took about 30, 35 minutes, uh, and they were unsuccessful. Ray says as more time passed not seeing Smith, rescue became less and less likely. The team started shifting to recovery. Enter Shelby Flegel, a Springfield Township firefighter and the handler of Darwin, Lucas County's cadaver dog. The dogs can tell us uh, within reason where the body is, and it helps divers save time from uh, you know, having to look in a bunch of different areas. Flegel says between Darwin and ODNR sonar, the team was getting closer to finding Smith. But they soon realized they were racing against another ticking clock. They were losing daylight, potentially forcing the operation to be suspended after dark and leaving Smith's family without answers for a whole night. Uh, the dive team decided to make uh, another dive, um, another pass, and uh, then uh, until we ran out of uh, daylight, and they went down on the second dive, and with about three or four minutes, uh, they, they discovered the, uh, the victim. Ray says recoveries like this one are bittersweet for the divers. The, the hope is that you're always going to find somebody and be able to bring somebody back, and they're alive. Um, unfortunately, that doesn't always happen, uh, and this was recovery. But I think the solace for the dive team was is that at least they were able to start to give some closure to the family. And that was Michael Sandlin reporting. The Henry County Sheriff's Office has determined that this was having no foul play in Smith's death.